Hey there, this is Allie from the product marketing team here at Fullscript. Today, I'm really excited to show you the new plan writing workflow. We've simplified how you'll write plans, gathering all the core actions into a single place and reducing the number of ways to get there, freeing up a little brain space that you can redirect to patient care. First, it's important to note that we've removed the terminology of recommendation and prescription. What you craft and send from Fullscript is now simply known as a plan for all practitioners and their patients, regardless of practitioner modality. This will carry over into the patient experience as well, so you don't need to worry about updating or modifying terminology preferences in your account settings. When you want to write a plan, there are still a couple of ways to start that action, like from the quick start menu here or from your patient list. But what I wanna show you today is your new plan writing hub, which starts with this button here, build plan. This is where all of your plan writing workflows are going to be organized. Clicking this button in your navigation will bring you to your plan writing page. From here, you can easily take your desired action. So before this release, things like writing plans, editing sent plans, creating templates, or sharing a plan with multiple or all patients sort of lived in different parts of your account. Bouncing around the platform looking for these different actions led to a lot of lost time. So from this plan writing page, you can decide if you want to start writing a brand new plan for an individual patient, or one that you plan to send to multiple or all patients. We previously used the terms shareable protocols or shareable wellness protocols, but we've now simplified that as well to just simply a multi-patient plan. You'll also see if you scroll down that you can start a plan from a template. You'll see templates that you've created here under my dispensary. Um, and this is where you can create a new one or access ones that you've already created. There are also uh, templates that are created by Fullscript and you can find these here. Um, these are all made by Fullscript's in-house medical advisory team. Um, we used to refer to them as protocols, but these are where you can find the templates provided by Fullscript for free that contain evidence-based protocols. Let's dive into the individual plan to start. So this is going to look very similar to the plan writing tools that you're used to, but with a few improvements. On the right-hand side is where you can control who gets this plan. You can actually still at this point change your mind and decide to send it to multiple patients at once, but in this case we've entered with the intention of sending it to an individual patient. You can uh, search your list of patients here to find the one you wish to send it to, or you can even create a new patient at this point. So let's go ahead and just select a patient that's been created. As usual, um, you can use a snippet, which is a pre-saved message or a set of instructions, in order to save time, or you can also apply a template to save time. So in the previous screen on your plan writing flow, you can start a plan from an existing template, or you can go ahead and start your plan and then apply a template from here. So clicking this is going to bring out your catalog drawer. And again, you can leverage your own templates here, or you can use a template that has been created by Fullscript um, that contains evidence-based protocols. Um, we have over 40, they're free for you, to, for you to use, and they're a great sort of starting point to save time or can also help with decision support. You're now going to see this larger sort of catalog drawer, which is also relatively new. It contains all the things that you may want to apply to a plan. So products, of course, which live in the catalog, as well as those templates we just talked about, products that you've organized by favorites, as well as patient resources. Uh, you can also add your own uh, attachments or resources, or you can choose from a number of patient resources that again have been created by our in-house medical team. They're also evidence-based uh, and they are, uh, follow under a number of different categories. There's infographics, handouts, um, they range on everything from supplement information to physical activity to meal plans. So that's really all there is to it. You're going to craft your individual patient plan largely the same way by selecting your patient. Here is where it will show their discount, uh, whether you're a, a profit account or a nonprofit account, it will list it here. And then whether you're applying a template, bringing out that catalog drawer, or you're clicking to add supplements and resources, you will add everything that you desire to the plan, craft your message, and then send. Next, let's jump back and look at what it's like to create a multi-patient plan. So when you land on the plan writing tool for the multi-patient workflow, it will look very similar to crafting a plan for an individual. Where it's different is, again, on this right-hand side where you'll determine who will receive it and what you'll call it. You will need to give your plan a title so that patients receiving it know what it's meant to treat or uh, prevent or optimize. Under access, you're going to determine if you want all of your patients to receive it or just a group of select patients. Um, you can also distinguish between your specific patient list and the entire patient list if you're in a multi-practitioner account and your settings allow for it. 
Uh, something that is relatively new is that now if you send a, uh, a a plan to all of your patients, so your entire dispensary, you can enable an email notification to be sent to patients. So previously, when you sent a plan to all patients, uh, you could generate a link to share with them directly, but there was no option uh, to use Fullscript to notify all of your patients that they now have access to a new plan or protocol. So that's something that is new that we've uh, introduced. Practitioners were asking for the ability to um, uh, share that information with their patients and make them aware. Um, so you can now do that and they will receive an email from us the same way they would uh, if they received an individual plan that you sent them. Just letting them know that you sent name of plan uh, and with a link that they can uh, come in and check it out and self-serve. And when you've created your multi-patient plan, if you click publish plan, it will bring you to your shared plans page, which will give you an overview of all the plans that have been shared with multiple patients as well as who has access. This is also accessible from the shared plans tab under plans in your navigation. This concludes the walkthrough of the new plan writing workflow in Fullscript. How you write plans should still feel very, very familiar, but with everything you need now at your fingertips in one convenient flow, whether you're crafting or using a template, sending to an individual patient or multiple, editing a plan or changing access, or even attaching resources, you'll be more efficient freeing up time that you can spend with your patients or building your practice.